Hey everyone. The other day someone asked me who was not a Houdini user. They've been using Blender, but they're a really good sculptor and texture artist. They were kind of more into the assets. They were asking me how easy would it be to take like a concept sculpt and get that into Houdini and render it and apply textures that you've done maybe in Copernicus or in Substance Paint or Mari and just kind of get that automated so you could have one model with maybe three different texture packs so you could essentially look at it from a USD point of view and say this asset in our case we're going to choose this monster here this asset is going to be um, containing three material variants and then maybe later on we do a few different sculpts that's part of the same monster type and we could have geometry variants and then for each one of those geometry variants we could have material variants so and you want to apply all those textures on and do a look dev and test this whole thing out in a different light rig and and automate it and have it all labeled and stuff what i'm going to do is i'm going to use a sculpt that i made on the ipad a while back it was about 14 pounds and i bought it obviously five years ago and it's just been getting amazing updates and then now it ships with um quad remesher for an additional 14 pounds and it's just a one-off purchase there's no subscriptions this project is going to fulfill two needs it's going to demonstrate how you would get something into houdini that's not finished and produce a production like almost a production ready thing that i can use in a little animation in using vellum maybe you want to make this explode or maybe you want to make loads of different ones going down some steps or maybe you just want to throw this around and have some fun or even maybe you just want to pose your sculpt a different way and then re-render it in a turntable so it got me thinking that this would actually be quite a fun video for people who are maybe new to houdini and obviously blocked by the um the complexity that houdini offers but also with this new usd structure that can actually be quite daunting so stick around if you're interested and we'll go through the whole process in the next video we'll just we'll just discuss the asset and then we'll just make our way through it